Hi, this is Tutor Nick P, and this is lesson 580. Title of today's lesson is When to Capitalize Internet and When Not to. And it's an update because <clears throat> I did a video on it like three years ago or four years ago, where the answer I think was a lot clearer back then, but it has become less clear now. All right, let's get into it. Unfortunately, in recent years, the question has become more muddled, which is more confused than a decade ago. Originally, Internet was considered to be a proper noun and was capitalized to distinguish the global Internet, you know, the worldwide Internet, um, such as the World Wide Web, from local Internets within companies or organizations. So they could have an Internet that just connects the computers within their own company or organization. By extension, one would also capitalize the web and the net when it referred to the internet. And this is still true. And you got to, you know, distinguish it, you know, because, of course, net can mean like a basketball net or a fishing net. Those don't get capitalized. Of course not. Or, um, of course, the web, you could have a spider web, you know, or you could have some other sort of a web. All right, let's continue. <clears throat> Don't capitalize internet if it is used as an adjective or as part of a noun phrase, like an internet connection or internet ads, etc. So here's a clear difference. So, uh, you know, only if it's really referring to the internet, the worldwide one, if it's used as an adjective or uh, a noun phrase, no, don't capitalize. Let's continue. The reason it's becoming more muddled is major dictionaries are accepting both uppercase and lowercase as acceptable uh, when referring to the World Wide Web. Now, there is a change. Again, you know, I'm an English teacher. I look at these dictionaries over the years, and it's been kind of a change. Like 10 years ago or a little longer ago, they didn't do that. They, uh, they said, nope, just the capital. But now they're saying, well, maybe both are okay now. Okay. Okay, let's continue. Uh, all right, one first. Several major publications have dropped the capital, such as the Associated Press, the New York Times, etc. There are a few. Uh, Oxford Dictionary in 2016 stated the capitalized version remained dominant in the U.S., while the lowercase was preferred in Britain. So this is why it's becoming more muddled. Even though, to be on the safe side, I think you should still capitalize it. It's safer, because if you don't capitalize it, there's probably going to be somebody who's saying, no, you're wrong. You should capitalize it. So you're better off capitalizing. Both di dictionaries are still saying both are okay. So you're safer capitalizing it. All right, let's continue. Uh, all right, good. And we just got three examples to kind of, you know, show this updated information. Uh, she got a new internet service provider. Again, here it's like you as part of a noun phrase. Okay. Uh, so it's not capitalized there. The internet can be used to find vast amounts of information. Again, here's where it's used alone. I think you should still capitalize it. But again, maybe there are some publications where saying you don't have to do that now. Uh, you know, or maybe maybe in Britain, maybe it might be okay. I'm not sure. But that's that's the updated information here. I found the information on the net. I, I think when you refer to the internet, it's probably still better to capitalize it just so there's no question about whether, you know, it's one of these other types of nets, like, you know, a, um, a basketball net or a fishing net or something like that. Okay. Anyway, I hope you got it. I hope it was clear. I hope it was informative. Thank you for your time. Bye-bye.